Climate Launchpad by now is the largest uh, green business idea competition on this planet. Uh, last year, in 2022, uh, we ran in 59 countries on five continents. Now, Climate Launchpad was founded in 2014 by Frans Nauta and I was one of the lucky guys to be uh, part of the founding team. And at the time we, f we founded Climate Launchpad because we wanted to have early stage green ideas into the European Climate Kick Accelerator, the EIT Climate Kick Accelerator. It's by now uh, the largest green business accelerator um, in Europe. Um, in 2012, the end of 2012, there were more than 1,800 1, startups in it who altogether closed more than 1.5 billion euros in external finance. And so all of these green ideas should go into the climate launch pad. But what we did not see coming is that this exploded into the largest green business idea competition on this planet. In five years, we just were from uh, zero to 50 countries. What we're doing here in this climate launch pad bootcamp, we're talking about clean tech. And uh, clean tech, in my definition, is any technology and or business model that reduces climate impact on the input side of our economies. So think about fresh water resources, think about um, um, energy use, think about food and agricultural resources, think about materials use. And on the output side of, of our economies, emissions to air, land and water, like for, inst for instance greenhouse gas emissions that cause global warming, solid waste, nuisance noise hinder. So clean tech reduces all of this on the input and the output side. And actually I think that's what the world needs and that would also be good, be good for Morocco. Just last week, a report came out by RMI, the Rocky Mountain Institute, and the Bezos Earth Fund, basically predicting, amongst other things, that, for instance, the cost of solar photovoltaics and wind will halve again in the next decade until 2030. And so this is not only a matter of climate change anymore, it's also a matter of economics, because things like photovoltaics and wind energy are in the money. This is the reason why we, uh, why we founded uh, uh, Climate Launchpad in 2014. I personally believe that we not only need the big solutions that everybody's talking about, like for instance the, the, the big solar, the big wind, maybe even the big new nuclear, all of that. We need thousands and thousands and thousands of startups, green startups on this planet, who are basically, for instance, creating entire new value chains for the circular economy. What we see happening in a new green economy is that entire new value chains are created and in each step of these value chains we need startups and we need so many of them that the, the potential for that in my view is endless. I have to say uh, that I'm very grateful also on behalf of Climate Launchpad that uh, UM6P and Stargaze are hosting us in this unbelievable amazing uh, location. Um, it's, uh, it, it's one of the best places actually I've ever been. The, the fantastic university, all the facilities here that, uh, that help the startups. Um, I can only say thank you so much.